Hi everyone, uh, I'm Sir Lairwag and in this video I'm going to uh, show you this uh, new racing build that I made. And, uh, first of all, I want to be clear, I'm still working on the dual screen pinball build with future pinball included, uh, but I have to put that aside for a while because my GPU died and a friend asked me if I can uh, make him a racing build and I thought it would be cool to share this with you uh, this is uh, still in beta because I want to test more uh, controllers and uh, stuff uh, but it's configured with uh, an Xbox controller so it should work with uh, any X input uh, steering wheel for example and it will require some tinkering if you have a steering wheel that is direct input I have a steering wheel and it is direct input so I didn't want to use this on the build because uh, uh, some changes should be made and it's where this because it has more compatibility with uh, most steering wheels out there uh, of course you always can uh, use this with an Xbox controller or any X input controller and it will sh it should work uh, uh, fine uh, what else? Okay, um, first of all, this build is prepared for uh, 16 by 9, but it also uh, has a layout for, for 4 by 3. I will talk about that uh, later. Uh, at the end of the video, I will show you where the settings are and how to change them. Um, what else? Uh, okay, on an Xbox controller, uh, it's it goes like this uh, with A of course you enter the game um, with X you can change from favorites to all games so uh, what else to add a game to favorites you can press B and it's added as you can see and with Y you can remove that game from favorites Okay, it will still be on uh, all games, but in favorites. Uh, as for uh, not being uh, looking for a game through all the wheel, uh, what else? To change a uh, letter up and down is R1 and L1. You can see, and with D pad up and down, you can go. Uh, to the next sub collection uh, it will start on arcade games and if I press down it will go to the next sub collection which is uh, Dreamcast in this case uh, next is GameCube as you can see the, the steering wheel changes this is PC games. This is uh, PlayStation 2 games. Uh, this is Triforce, which uh, runs on on Dolphin Triforce, and there is only these two games uh, working properly. Uh, with this, you will have to uh, when you exit the game, you will have to press twice Star Plus Select to to exit the emulator also. Uh, the rest of the emulators is just once stra star plus select and it will exit. Um, this is Wii games and I think that's all. Uh, I will maybe add more games later, PS1, N64, uh, something like that. Uh, this can also support uh, for a second screen marquee but I will 
I not include that in this particular uh, build it may go uh, next with an add-on with the marquees and maybe maybe some video marquees uh, I have some ideas but this is still on beta uh, okay let's uh, let's try again I will show you uh, how it runs okay uh, here with the analog stick I can go left right uh, RT on the Xbox is uh, the, the gas some games uses uh, A or B to to throttle, but uh, some uses the the analog of of the RT and LT. Uh, here the gears are A X Y B, uh, respectively. So B is my fourth gear. Uh, I like. To play this game on manual I can lower the shift and do that <laughs> okay hang in there okay uh, it works good let's exit with star plus select uh, all the games that are here I already tried them and they all work uh, but I will like to uh, some feedback uh, if some game doesn't work for you to see I want to provide support for this and not just release it and give everyone a headache I, I want that it works for for everyone um, Crazy Taxi, great game. Anyway, uh, let's. Uh, I will show you now the the folder structure. So um, here we have uh, the settings folder, and inside here you can apply accordingly uh, to what you like. This. Uh, these bot files and this will set everything to what I have right now which is 16 by 9 but if you have a for example an arcade one up uh, cabinet and you want to transform it into this uh, you can do that with uh, a 4 by 3 aspect ratio uh, some games are 5 by 4 but you will know not notice a huge difference this will stretch so there's no problem there uh, you can go attract mode off or on uh, if you mess something up you can reset the controllers and uh, you can start start on all the games or just the favorites and I think that's all uh, if you don't want some uh, sub collection to show you can do this for example you are uh, running this on a lower spec machine and PS2 games doesn't work for you you can go here delete that file only that file and that's all uh, PS2 will not show on the list and the same with with every other game if you want only arcade you can delete all the rest and but uh, this is for a kind of medium uh, spec PC uh, I think that's all I hope you enjoyed the video I hope you enjoy this build I really need some feedback on this because uh, I want to provide uh, a proper support for it and stay tuned for the next uh, pinball uh, versus arcade build 
uh, for dual screen because it will be coming up uh, probably next week so that's all uh, be safe and thanks for watching